On the last episode of Dragon Ball Z. Nah, but on the last episode of Black Chocolate Be Like Power 105 Part 8, I had Big Twan to pull up on me so we could catch up and help me to figure out how I was gonna get this bread to get Cookie Tesla out the impound. Lucky for me, he knew somebody that could help us to get some decent cash expeditiously. He ended up taking me to see this Italian mob boss type character by the name of Johnny Ice. The man had a wife, girlfriend, and a mistress. Wild as hell. Most importantly though, he had a way for us to run it up real quick and real fast. He presented us with a piece of paper detailing a mission that would yield $25,000. No kizzy. It wasn't really too much to talk about. Me and Big Twine got up out of there after that and got right to it. Now, I ain't know that the mission was pretty much going to be the Chicago rendition of Paper Soldiers. But motherfuckers needed that money, so home invasion it was. He had us breaking and entering into the home of some dude named Mickey Mammal. That of which it didn't take long to find out why his name was what it was. We had to deal with dogs, chameleons, real life animal planet activity. Even came across a whole turtle, turtle. And even after all of that, once we was finally about to find what we was sent to look for, I found myself covered in snakes. And one of them was definitely a descendant of the same snake that set Adam and Eve off in the Garden of Eden. Luckily, Big Twine was unfearful of the slithering serpents and was able to unwrap them from around my body. So after peeing my pants and suffering a slight heart attack, I found the packages that we were sent to retrieve. I remember my heart was beating so fast. I was so anxious. I was so happy that I was about to come up on this small fortune. And all we had to do was make a delivery straight to Johnny Ice. So you know I was scooping up everything and trying to get up out of there as fast as I could couldn't get to the truck fast enough i'm talking about tripping and falling in the street in some motion nevertheless we made a clean getaway and that man kept his word cashed us out 25 rackets we go to the gas station after that big twine end up seeing his little boo up there he hop out i bop out to see who shorty is and lo and behold to my utter surprise it's the same chick that stabbed Cookie up the day before. Plot twist. And at that point, that's when I needed y'all help. Well, the people have spoken. And y'all have elected for me to let Big Twan know what the 411 is. Say less. Eventually, Big Twan bought back in the car. My chest and head was knocking from what I just saw. I had to let him know what the situation was. We pull up to my crib. Ah, man, bro. You definitely put a motherfucker in position today. Thank you. I appreciate it, man. Heat, you already know, bro. Real nigga activity. With a deep sigh. Ah, yeah. And proceeded to reach for the door handle. Heat, you good, bro? I pause with another deep sigh. Ah, whole time, bro. Shorty, you just saw at the gas station. Your little situation. Small world, but that's the same girl that stabbed up Cookie. He, why you ain't say nothing? Ah, I know you really with Shorty shit, and you ain't had to do with that. So, I low key was figuring like I should just handle that with Cookie, like how we was, and leave you up out of it. He, bro, you my brother. Ain't no female coming in between what we got going on. Relieved, I love. He, man, just let me know what I need to do next for shorty. Pig, I, I'ma hit your line tomorrow, bro. I'm tired as hell. And bopped out to slide in the crib. Nowhere near as tense as I was just 10 minutes before. Next morning, I'm knocked out. I get a call. Whole time, it's Cookie FaceTiming me. I get up, grab the phone, 
I answer. I hello. She grand rising. I grand rising. She do you know what today is? I damn. It's our anniversary already. Woo. Time be flying, don't it? She no. Nah, it's the day I get up out this month. I t I know you glad. You probably been counting down since the last time I talked to you, huh? She, no, nah, not really. They gave me this new nurse and she cool as hell. She braided my hair and everything. I got a number so we can keep in touch. Ah, uh, uh, okay, that's what's up. Made your last little stint in that fake bearable, huh? She, they say I get discharged at one o'clock. Ah, uh, one o'clock? Say less, I'ma definitely be on point right there. She, when you pick me up, I want you to bring me some chicken too. Ah, I, I got you. Shocks, she, nah, I want Wilma's this time. Ah, Wilma's, where that say? She, it's on 147. Ah, oh, okay, say less. A 10 piece from there? She, yes sir. Ah, what you want to drink? She, a pink lemonade? Ah, I got you. She, if you a little late picking me up cause my Tesla need to charge. I'll understand. Right. <laughs> whole time you reminded me I do need to put gas in that motherfucking green bean. You know that what it take like forty two dollars to fill that bitch up, so that ain't gonna take long. That won't get in the way of me getting there on time for show for show. Disappointed she. Okay, well I see you later. I right, I right, baby, can't wait to see you. She. All right. Bye bye. The shade. I I. Right. Hurt that girl hard, but I couldn't wait to see the look on her face when she see that Tesla out front. But I had to take my OG Hukai back first before I went to go retrieve cookies from the impound. I get to my OG slot, her boyfriend opened the door, he, ha 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 ha, young buck, young buck. Is it okay if I call your stepson? I, hell no. Man, where my OG at? He, ha 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 ha, in due time, in due time, listen, she in the bathroom, washing some of her sins away. <laughs> you know what? Come on in, man. Come on. <laughs> Woo! I don't know where he got all that energy from. I step inside and sit on the couch. He, pardon my manners, young buck. <laughs> it's some prune juice back there if you want some. Probably on the swallow left. <laughs> Gotta go to the grocery store. Ah. Nah, I'm good. He, <laughs> hey, what's going on with your boy, Kanye? <laughs> he, he doing all that talky talk on that Instagram. <laughs> Listen, you better say something to your boy. I think they done blocked him on there. <laughs> all that gibbering and jabbering he doing. <laughs> He's something else. <laughs> that boy something else. Ugly as hell. I, hell yeah, shit. To each his own shit. Motherfuckers gonna feel how they feel about things. Kanye shrug. He, what they call it? Freedom of speech, boy? <laughs> Ain't no freedom no more, is it? That boy Kanye had 140 million in Chase. What Chase say? Get on up out of here with that shit, boy. <laughs> you can't bang with us no more. <laughs> we gonna holler at your pimp. <laughs> Get your ass out of here, boy. <laughs> ah, that's sh crazy shit. That's how it be. But show, he <laughs> that boy been coming blocks and got married. <laughs> so what that girl name? Uh uh uh, uh funny ass Xavier. That would uh, <laughs> that boy that took his last walk, man. It's old way for him. I don't know why he did that. I don't know why he would do something like that, man. It's old way. He might as well hang it up. Ah uh, yeah. What you know about them old man? He yeah man. I've been fooling around on my Android, messing with them social networks. My phone on 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 a charger in the back back there. But yeah, yeah, I follow them. I be checking them out. <laughs> them boys be dropping some knee slappers. <laughs> yeah, man. Something about that boy pronouncing them words mess with me, man. It mess with me a little bit, but he gonna be all right. God with him. Ah, word. That's what's up. I was barely listening to him for real. OG walked in from the shower. She, oh, hey, son. I ain't know you was here. What's up with you? Her boyfriend. There go my box of Hershey Kisses. <laughs> hey, baby. Blew me for real out. Hey, mama. Yeah, whole time I came to bring your cop back. I'm good now. 
Thank you so much. I toss her the keys. They fly right past the sheet. Boy, don't throw shit at me. Now come and pick them up. Ah, my bad, mama. I get up to go pick them up. Hoping she ain't swing on me. That's why I made sure not to have my back to her when I kneel down. She, now hand them to me like you got some home training. Snatch them and she, sit your ass down. It don't matter how old I get. Whenever my mama scold me, every feeling in my body always gonna be hurt. Her boyfriend, woo! <laughs> hey, you so aggressive. That's why I love you, I'm telling you. I love that woman for that, boy. <laughs> she Eddie? Oh, hush. Then she turned to me. Did you put some gas in my damn car? Ah, my bad, my mom forgot. I'ma send you a cash app though, I promise. She, don't play with me, boy. I better hear the sound of change dropping ASAP. Ah, yes, ma'am. I'm finna hop in this Uber and go get Cookie Kyle at the impound. Love you so much. She, I, baby. Love you too. Head into the door. Ah, I, Eddie. Nice shirt. He, ha, ha, ha. Your mama bought it for me. That's a nickname for me. She called me Bomb Pop. <laughs> Oh, gee, all right, son. Be safe and stay dangerous. Come on here, Eddie. Before placing a bottle of honey on the counter and taking her retainers out of her mouth, her boyfriend following up right behind her before vanishing into her bedroom. I know she was grown, but that's something I could never get used to. Made me sick to my stomach. I got a her. I hop in the Uber, the driver. So where we going, Duddy Road, the impound? Ah, hell yeah. I gotta get my car barra. SMH and heat. Damn, boy. The city thirsty than a motherfucker. I had to get my shit up out of there a couple times, man. The city done caught me lacking a few times. Ah, I'm trying to tell you. He, motherfuckers got me working two jobs. I'm trying to get the boot off my other car. It, it's ridiculous out here, man. Ah, man. What's your other hustle? He, I work for Amazon Flex too, shit. That's where you could deliver packages in your own car. Ah, all real nigga activity, man. Getting money multiple ways, I on it. Pulling over, he, let me deliver this real quick. It's gonna be real quick. Pulling out his phone, he. Look, she talking about bring it to the rear at the garage, though. Come to the front. Like, you fed. This gonna be real quick. And then he bopped out. As if this wasn't an active car share trip. I was so confused. He make the delivery. Hop back in the car. He. Muffer gave me a dollar tip. I mean I, I appreciate it. But damn. I, I, I couldn't get a fin. Damn. Where you going again? The uh, pound right? Speechless. I. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Whole time. You think. Uh. You can kind of put a pause on the deliveries until I get to my destination. He, I, right, I got you. I'm finna take you there right now. That was my last one till I on phone now. I got you. Ah, right, blessings. Looking down at his phone, he, God damn. I got one more delivery game. My fault. I, I, this the last one. Oh, my baby, this the last one. Then he hop out the car again. I'm just looking like ain't no fucking way, boy. Ain't no fucking way, boy, because he got me crisscrossed at this point. He hopped back in the car from the second delivery. He, motherfuckers, too broke to give me a tip this time. Good looking for your patience, Brody. Trying to dap me. I just looked at his ass. He, damn, fuck. I, I'm trying to get somewhere and you steady. Doing all these little drop-offs like how I'm supposed to feel about that, though. He, what you mean how you supposed to feel about that? First of all, you just rejected my little you did. Man, motherfuckers will get up out this vest and really do that to you, fuck. I'm trying to be cool. I'm working two jobs at the same time. I'm finna take you where you need to go. You would have thought I was inconveniencing him. I'm just sitting there like, nah, you ain't gonna give it to me like that. We eventually get that. He, I right, man. We made it to your destination. He put the car in pocket, but I think you should reevaluate how you handle a motherfucker, man. I'm working two jobs. Trying to make an honest living. You trying to make me feel bad about it, foe. I could have put the knuckles on your ass, you know what I'm saying?
but I'm a professional now. So I'm going to give you a pass. But you be blessed, man. And make sure you give me them five stars, folk. I wanted to get the rear range and cup holders in that motherfucker for real, but I just let it go and got up out of the could nothing ruin the blessing of me being able to get cookie kyle out the impound she was gonna be too geek right after that i went straight to wilms to go get her chicken that was my first time in there a pretty decent establishment for real go to order the lady hi welcome to wilms how may i help you didn't even have to wait that long i blessings um i'm trying to get a 10 piece fried hot um Mouse sauce on the side, lemon pepper on the chicken. She, would you like something to drink? I, uh, a pink lemonade to do my fucks justice. She, okay, would there be anything else for you? I, um, man, I see y'all got turkey tips, but y'all probably be making that on the same grill y'all use to make the pork tips, don't y'all? She actually, the grill that we use for the turkey products is separate from the grill that we use for the pork products. And we don't do all that mixing and mingling up in here at Wilma's. Ah, what? Y'all, conscientious as hell in here. She, let me get a small turkey tip then and um, she throw a pink lemonade with that too. She, that total will be forty-one seventy. I go to pay for it. She, that'll be forty-one seventy. Swipe. Would you like a receipt with that? Ah, right, nah, I'm Gucci. She, that'll be 15 to 20 minutes for your wait, okay? I right, say less. Blessings. Now, while I'm standing there waiting for my food to come up, I peep out my peripheral. This little powerful piece of pound cake playing a little casino game they had up in there off in the cut. And I'm a holding, you hear me? <sighs> and she, herbo voice. She must have turned around. She, hey. That shoe while sipping her little drink, asking about the Tesla. Looking back, ah, hell yeah. About time that car got me the right attention. She just nodded her head and faced forward back towards her game. My fool finally came up. I walk up to the counter and grab it along with my drinks. I pimp out the restaurant. I go to get in the car. Now, as I'm opening the door, Shorty from inside, she, excuse me trying to get my attention i turn out yes ma'am she can i talk to you for a second biting her lip i okay give me one second i go to put the food and the drinks down in the car while thinking of myself like i wonder what could she possibly want to say to me i what's up she pimp right up to me she get to me instantly up right to my stomach I should have knew though. She had on black Air Force Ones. You can't trust nobody with black forces on. Ah, what you want? She, I need the keys to this motherfucker. ASAP, no Rocky. Looking around, ah, in broad daylight? You strong. She, matter of fact, get your chest in the car. At this point, I'm looking. Dumb as hell, she. Climb your ass up to the passenger side from the driver's side, motherfucker. Poking me with the pipe. I oblige and began to hop over the armrest into the passenger. She hop in, close the door. She, how you start this? Ain't no buttons in this motherfucker. And disbelief, I, man, your ass tweaking for real. She, man, how you start this? God, I pop your ass, bro. That's summation with a deep sigh. I, you gonna have to kill me. She, you know what? That's not a bad idea. I can pop your ass now. Hop on YouTube. Figure this shit out and dump your ass in Lake Michigan later. Shorty wasn't playing. Ah, can I can I at least have my last meal first? She bit and put the cup to my face. She got real. She was finna blow that m at any second. Boys to men, I figured it was the end of the road. All I could do was close my ass. Next thing you know, she just fall forward and get the crying. I just knew she was about to put me on the next flight out. Thank God, she, I don't even know why I'm doing this shit. Like, I'm just trying to take care of my kids. I can't kill nobody. I ain't know what to say. She, I'm sorry. Don't call the police. Please don't call the police. I, real nigga activity. 
I ain't gonna call the police. She, me and my baby daddy got into it. He came in my crib and stole all my money out my safe and ran off. Me and my kids, we finna get evicted. I'm f***ed up out here. I'm just trying to come up on a quick lick. Ah. Damn, I'm sorry to hit it. Well, I appreciate you for allowing me to keep my fucking vessel. It was a little under $10,000 left after getting Cookie Kyle out the impound, so I, I got a rack for you. Up the road and peeled off for her. Right there, she. Really? You a real nigga. For real, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. You got a bit. On that, I. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie to you. She, well, you tell that she better make sure she hold on to you because she lucky as hell. I, I'ma make sure to let her know. Putting the money in her bra, she, but I'm finna get on up out of here. You make sure you be safe and stay dangerous. Bop right out the car and disappeared into the parking lot. Pound, only in Chicago. I finally get to the emergency room to bring Cookie home. As we was walking out, I, they done freed my nigga up out that jam. Welcome home. She a blessing. Can't wait to get back in my bed. I ain't gonna lie to you. Ah, I'm already knowing. But whole time. How you coming on your first day out freestyle, shorty? You probably should be like. Shorty stabbed me. I know you thought you had me, but it's up. On sight. Me and you like Cassie. Fake Timmy. I'm trying to put her on bars, you hear me? She, boy, would you stop playing so much and point me to the green bean? I'm ready to go home. All right, we're going to get you there ASAP. Turn it to the street. I right, there you go right there. Pointing right in the direction of where the Tesla was parked. Looking, she, oh my God, you got my uh, Tesla back. Happy as hell. All right, first let me hop out the muck and Tesla. I don't, I don't like it. Uh -uh. <laughs> oh, my mom. Surprise, surprise, she, thank you, babe, and ran up and hugged me so tight, even though it hurt, and ran as fast as she possibly could under the circumstances to get into the Tesla. She was looking like a kid running to the toy aisle. I loved it to see it. We bopped in and peeled off. We driving on the way home. She in the pasture doing that 10 piece from Wilma's. Dirty, filthy, you hear me? I peep out. Ain't nobody about to take that food from you, little bite. Slow down. She, I'm hungry as hell. That hospital food went on nothing. Leave me alone. I, I feel you. Just don't bite your finger during the process. I was concerned. She, you worried about the wrong things. You ain't get you no food to focus on? Uh, I got me some turkey tips whole time. I'ma see what's to when we get home. In between bites, she, how you get the money to get my car out back? Ah, thinking about them licks I hit, I had to face time out. Motherfuckers made it happen. She, I ain't gonna question God's blessings. Right after that, my BM texts me. She, hey baby daddy, ah, hey baby mama, so with you? She, what you doing? Ah, in traffic? She. Can you get my line for a couple days? I, yes, ma'am, on the way. She, I need to see you in a couple days too. I, you're crazy. She, I said what I said. I, say less, SMH. Cookie, who is that over there that got you looking so suspicious? I, oh no, that was just my BM. She want me to come get my line and keep her for a couple days. She, oh, that's fine. You over there acting like y'all still fucking or something. I, <laughs> you funny as hell. What King Louis say? Little did they know. Like 40 minutes later, we pulled up to go get my line. She was always so happy to see me. I opened the door for her to get into the Tesla. She looked, she, wow, daddy, that's cool. I told her to hop in. To her, she probably thought she was riding in one of the Transformers or something. Glad I was able to provide her with that experience. She, Wow, daddy, you have a new car? Ah, nah, this Cookie car. Say hi to Cookie. She, hi, Cookie. Cookie, hi, Milan, nice to meet you. Milan, you have a nice car. My daddy doesn't have a car. 
cookie yeah i'm aware milan my daddy didn't pay the bill on his last two cars so somebody took him i'm looking like is you serious she my daddy still wears the keys on his belt in case they give the cars back uh okay milan that's enough quiet on the set cookie she's so cute milan daddy can we go to the park ah uh, nah we need to go home and it's cold outside milan hmm cookie she can go to the park I, I was just trying to look out for you, shit. I figured you want to get home as soon as possible. She, nah, it's cool. I'm going to just sit in the car while y'all do y'all thing. Uh, I, I, Milan, but only for a little while. It's finna get dark. She, yay, thank you, daddy. An additional reminder that the day wasn't bad at all. We get to the pod. Milan take off running immediately. As a kid, I used to play in the park. Now I gotta pay parking tickets. Ah, right, we not finna be here that long, ma'am. It's cold as hell. She okay, daddy, and proceeded to frolic in her youth. Right after that, Big Twine FaceTime me. Ah, right, what's good with you, bro? He, you good, bro? I just wanted to make sure you was decent. Hope you ain't spend all your money in one place. But nah, look, man, shorty been blowing up my line, yeah? Me? Ah. Oh yeah, what's she on? He, I ain't pick up shit. You gotta let me know what's up. Ah, real nigga activity. He, man, come on, man. You know what's going on. But I gotta bust this little move right quick. I'ma hit your line later. Ah, blessings. I hang up. I look around. I don't see Milan. Ah, Milan. Now the little play area wasn't nowhere near that big for real. She wasn't on or under the slides or nothing. I look in the distance, I see Jacques homie, the same homie that was at his crib when I went and picked the blick up carrying my daughter away. I instantly take off running trying to hog Buddy down while he trying to stuff my daughter in some van. He was real life trying to kidnap my baby. Tell me why I'm running and trip over them big ass Yeezy boots I had on. He hop in a truck with my daughter. Before I can get up, he skirt. Jacques called me at that very moment. I pick up. He, come on, you ain't think I was gonna let you get away with that shit that easy, did you? Ah, man, where my daughter at? He, we'll get to all that. But you know that was an illegal search whole motherfucking time. So you know motherfucker wasn't finna be up in there too long. Ah, where the fuck is my daughter? He, easy, easy, easy. Calm the down. Now, if you wanna see your daughter, you gotta do something for me. I couldn't believe I was in this situation. I just wanted to scream. He, the only way to get your daughter back is to take care of somebody for me. I take care. What the fuck is you talking about take care? He, simple. I need you to murder somebody for me. And if you try to go to the police, it's over with for your little one. Once you complete the task, you'll get her back. And then I won't have to worry about you snitching because you'll have a body on your hands. If I go down, you'll have to go down with me. I'm going to hit your land tomorrow with further instructions. Y'all heard that shit? What am I supposed to do? I need y'all help. Should I call this bluff and just call the police and let them get my baby back? Or should I just deliver on his demands and take whoever it is up out of here? Drop it in the comments and let me know what I need to do. And on the next episode, we gonna see what's up. I need my daughter back. Let me know. Oh God. I just want my bitch back. Everybody hate, fuck her friends. All them hoes getting diss tracks. I was only fucking hoes. I was gonna get right back. Add some sneaky links, a couple midnight snacks. Never hit them at the crib, cause I ain't built like that. I was only trying to whoop shit. Brittany was thick. She had a waist tuck Never had my line I only called her on Facebook She used to slide on the block